So you've posed the question, you make sure they understand the question. I usually also try to do some prior research, try to find three to five good websites where they can start at. I also always try to bring in secondary materials, uh, whether it's books that I've gotten from the library, newspaper articles. Uh, sometimes we'll even watch a video that, that will introduce the big question if it's topical. During the investigation phase, the students break into groups and they choose their own groups. They start to think about a route of action to take and start exploring the topic and subject matter, um, both through conversation and through research on the internet. We do that for about 30 minutes, and uh, usually that whole 30 minutes goes by really quickly because they're just immersed in trying to figure the answer out to the question. I really understand more when I'm looking for things myself, and the fact that I can look for other resource sites than just the teacher. Like, oh, this site says this, but this site says something different, so I can compare the two and see which one is better, or combine the two to make one greater idea. With high schoolers, I usually have them in groups of four with two computers, and sometimes uh, with Seoul, you only have one computer, but with high schoolers, sometimes it's a little easier to have those two computers there. Um, sometimes I'll let them use their phones, depending on if they want to work a little bit more independently and then come back to their group. During this time, they're allowed to get up and walk around to other groups to see what they may be finding, and then they can come back to their group. Collaboration is really important. They work together in a group, but they also can switch groups at any point, which is great because the classroom is a living organism. They're working together all the time, whether they know it or not. But of course, it has to be a little strict to make sure that we don't go over and start you know, uh, socializing with group, other groups and things like that. But um, really, there's not a whole lot of guidelines. That's the beauty of the soul, is that you know, it's really what the student wants to do. Um, because in the end, they know that they're going to have to present out their information. 